I just want to uh, go back to the story. The Treasury has said banking firms will be forced to explain and delay any decision to close an account under new rules uh, designed to protect freedom of expression. Now, following that, that was relating, of course, to the Nigel Farage case uh, with his bank accounts closed by Coots. And now, uh, as you can see there, the Coots owner, Nat West, has apologised or is apologising in uh, a letter to Nigel Farage. So let's just get more on that. Our city editor, Mike, um, uh, Mark Kleinman, is on the line. And Mark, so just uh, bring us up to date. What uh, does this letter contain? Yeah, it's a pretty humiliating climb down from Dame Alison Rose, the chief executive of NatWest Group. That's the taxpayer-backed lender which owns Coots. And in this letter to Mr Farage, she says that she apologises for what she calls the deeply inappropriate comments about yourself made in the now-published papers prepared for the Wealth Committee. These are the papers that Mr Farage himself had obtained and disclosed to various newspapers in recent days in which the bank had made various pejorative remarks about his uh, political views and his alleged uh, links to... Uh, to senior figures in Russia and elsewhere. Now, in this letter to Mr Farage, Dane Allison says that the comments made in those internal bank papers uh, do not reflect the view of the bank. She says, I believe very strongly that freedom of expression and access to banking are fundamental to our society, and it's absolutely not our policy to exit a customer on the basis of legally held political and personal views. Now, Dane Allison, in this letter to Nigel Farage, goes on, uh, to say that she has ordered an immediate review of Coote's processes relating to account closures. She, she says that this review will report directly to her, and she says she also welcomes uh, other reforms announced recently in relation to the City Watchdog uh, and its uh, rules associated with politically exposed uh, persons. Of course, the Treasury has just confirmed what we were reporting on Sky News yesterday as well, that uh, bank customers whose accounts are to be closed will from now on be given three months' notice rather than the current 30 days, and also that they will have to be given explicit reasons for the closure of their accounts. Uh, the thinking behind that is that it will make appeals, successful appeals against account closures, much more likely in future. So some uh, developments on this uh, ongoing row between Nigel Farage and Coots with the NatWest CEO, Alison Rose, apologising to the former UKIP leader. OK, and Mark, no word, I suppose, on a reaction from Nigel Farage just yet? Well, we've only just obtained... I've only just seen a copy of this letter to Mr Farage, uh, Mark. I'm sure, uh, as uh, it has been uh, shown over the last few days, Nigel Farage is unlikely to be shy in uh, <laughs> exhibiting a response to this apology from Dame Alison Rose. No, absolutely. OK, Mark, thank you very much indeed for that uh, update.